Hello students, in this video we'll actually uh, use scientific notation um, in some practical examples. So I'll do the first one and then, then let you guys have a go at the remaining three questions. So a 10 cent coin in Australia is about 0 0.0015 meters thick. So to write that in scientific notation, I have to move the decimal point um, after the first non-zero digit. So that's going to become 1.5 times 10 to the power of negative 3, since I moved it three places. Okay, try the remaining three questions. Okay, with the second one, we got to be a little bit careful here. Pluto is approximately 5,900 million kilometers from the sun. So first, I'm going to write that as a normal number. 5900, zero, zero, and then I've got to add six more zeros for the million. So there it is written as an ordinary number. And now in scientific notation, I've got to move my decimal point three, six, nine places. So times 10 to the power of nine. Okay, the next one, I need to put my, dec my decimal point after the three. So it's going to be three. And I'm going to move it three, six, seven places. So times 10 to the negative seven. And for the last one, again, we're illustrating here that sometimes it's easier to just write the normal number, not scientific notation. So for that one, 1.063, I move my decimal point three places. So times 10 to the third. So for this one here, you're better off just writing it as 1,063. Okay, let's go back the other way. I'll do the first one, and I'll let you write, um, then work out the answers to the remaining three. So radio waves travel at about 10, uh, sorry, 3 by 10 to the 8th meters per second. So I write down the 3, and now I've got to move my decimal point, which is after the 3, um, 8 places to the right. So I need to put in some zeros. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So my decimal point has moved from there to there. Put in some commas. And three by 10 to the eighth is 300 million. Okay, stop the video and have a go, please. Okay, welcome back. In a hydrogen atom, the average distance between the proton and the electron is 1.5 by 10 to the negative 15th meters. Well, once again, I'm going to have to leave a little bit of space before I start writing. So I write the 1.5 to start with. I'll put it way back here. And then I've got to move my decimal point 15 places to the left. So one place and then 14 zeros. So 1, 2, 3, 4, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, who only just left enough space. And there it is. So I should have actually left a little bit more space, but anyhow, that'll, that'll do. Thickness of fine paper is about 1.2 by 10 to the negative four meters. Well, again, write the one, two, move the decimal point back four places, one, two, three, four. And the other way you could have done it is write one, two, and then put three zeros in front of it because there's always one less than whatever that digit is. Last question. The distance from the sun to Jupiter is 7.78 by 10 to the eighth kilometers. Will we write the 778? And I've got to move my decimal point eight places. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight. And that gives us 778 million kilometers. Okay, one more video in the series. What we'll do in the next one is actually do some calculations involving scientific notation using a scientific calculator.